Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I would like to welcome you all on behalf of the Clements family. As the bride's father, I am charged with telling you a little bit about our Charlotte. Charlotte has always been very, very determined and knows exactly what she wants. She has always been very focused in achieving her dreams. She is very studious and has always studied hard to reach her goals. We are proud of her as a family. Kate and myself got to know Gary when Charlotte first started dating him. He would come round on a Sunday just before dinner time and as we were preparing the roast dinner, he would then tell us about the oven ready dinners he and his brother had cooked at their bachelor pad. And naturally, we would invite him to stay for dinner. Over time, I got to know that Gary had not only good taste in choosing Charlotte, but also in his music. He knows and listens to most of the music on my CD and record collection, unlike my two daughters. Charlotte, Mum so wanted to see you married, and although she is not with us, I know she is here in spirit and enjoying your special day. On behalf of Mum, Dad, myself and Kate, we sincerely hope that life grants you both with many years of happiness, good health, lots of fun, and most importantly, an improving taste for music. If I could ask you to give Gary Charlotte's ring for me. Well, thank you. And Gary, if you could place it halfway down Charlotte's finger, hold it there and repeat these words. With this ring. With this ring. I promise to love and care for you. I promise to love and care for you. To comfort and protect you. To comfort and protect you. To listen and confide in you. To listen and confide in you. To respect your thoughts and your dreams. To respect your thoughts and your dreams. And to trust and believe in you. To trust and believe in you. Above all others. Above all others. With this ring, I promise to love and care for you. I promise to love and care for you. To comfort and protect you. To comfort and protect you. To listen and confide in you. To listen and confide in you. To respect your thoughts and your dreams. To respect your thoughts and your dreams. And to trust and believe in you. To trust and believe in you. Above all others. Above all others. From the beginning, I knew Gary was a quick learner. Well, he had to be with my father around. Uh, teaching him how to dodge a flying moccasin from point blank range was a fine art, but we got it through all right, didn't we, mate, eh? Yeah, it's good Yeah, yeah. As brothers, we have a lot in common, as you would expect. Not all good things, like the tendencies to always be right and always have the last word on everything, and I mean everything. But on a serious note, I'm very proud of you, the man you've become, a very strong, willed man that knows what he wants. I'm very proud. I would like to welcome Charlotte into the Abbey's family. I hope you know what you're doing. <laughs> and finally, I would like us all to raise a toast to the newlyweds, Mr. and Mrs. Abbess. <laughs> to Mr. and Mrs. Abbess. Thank you.
for coming. Honestly, it's made the day as special as it could be for us. Uh, and we wouldn't have had it any other way, would we, sweetheart? So yeah, thank you very much, everyone. Thank you, enjoy your evening. Sweetheart, you look beautiful and I couldn't have asked for anything more.